Hello everyone, it's Laurel here from Clever Book Creations and I am here to share a swap that I am having with Miss Maggie Stone. Um, she also has a Facebook group called The Vintage Ones and I joined her group and they do a lot of pocket letters in there. So this is a pocket letter swap for fall. So it's not due yet, but um, she got hers done early. So I wanted to get it filmed just before I um, got hers mailed off. I didn't want to open it, but I've kind of been sitting here hanging on to it. So I do want to open it and uh, and get it and look at it and see everything. So um, I have it turned over because my address is on the other side, but I did cut open the side of the bag. So I am going to go ahead and open it and I will share Angie's group below. I'm not sure if Angie has... She's got to have a YouTube. I'll make sure to share all that in the description box below so you guys can go check her out. So, the bag, and this is here just because my light shines on my glass. So, here we go. So, let's see. Oh my goodness. And someone went a little crazy. All right. I want to see the pocket letter, but. Oh, I think it came out. Did it come out? Yep, it did. It came out. That's where these go. Sorry, they came out. I don't know how, but I'm going to put them back in and pray I know where they go. Those ones are gone. Let the solid ones go in the bag. The decorated ones go in the case. So let's see. This one. Hmm. Sorry, guys. I didn't... Uh, plan on this coming apart, but it obviously did, so I'm trying to put it back together and then kind of show it all to you guys. I can't wait to look at it either. So here's another back paper to one of them. I just don't know which one. So this, oh, that says reading, so this goes in one of them. I'm going to stick this one right in here. This, no, it's got to go this way. It doesn't fit in there. All right, so... Oh, here we go. This has got to be one of them. And then, then this has got to be one down here. So we're going to stick this one here and this one here. And I'm guessing this other stuff fell out of the back of it just through the mail. So I'm sure it was in one of the pockets in the back, this little stuff. So we'll look at that in a minute. So let's pull out the thing that says read me. And there's a shaker. I wonder where the shaker went. I wish I could have seen this the way it was. I'm sorry it all fell apart. So this is, I know in a pocket letter, there's supposed to be a little letter in there. That's why it's called a pocket letter. And it's supposed to describe a little bit about you. So this says read me. So I'm going to go ahead and read it. I don't know if I should read it out loud, but I'm going to read it to myself a minute. So she gives me, uh, and it says notes from the witch. And it just tells me um, the things she likes and what she likes to collect. Okay, and then, then she's going to tell me a little bit about herself. And she's telling me about her family. She's telling me about her children and grandchildren. Wow. Ooh, she has Maine Coon cats. Awesome. That's right. I do remember her showing them to us. One of them. That is awesome. Awesome. Thank you, Angie. That's so nice to know. I'm not going to read it to everybody that because that's kind of for me. But it was really nice. She told me a little bit about herself. So let's look at her wonderful pocket letter. I'm guessing that's glued there. I don't think it's supposed to come off. Oh, yes, it is. I think it just got stuck. I love the um, eyelash lace that she's got going through here. I think she mixed a bunch of them together, but that looks awesome like that. And then she made all these little pictures with leaves, and that's a, um, an acorn. And then she did burlap flowers. Uh, and then 
and she made them hard and this one's got a turkey and if you pull it out there's a flower on there and an apple that's a cool sticker and this one says happy thanksgiving and it's a little tag and then this one has got a leaf on it with some um not orange but like a deeper orange uh crochet trim and then again we have another burlap flower and some leaves and a pumpkin and a doily and leaves and a pumpkin oh, and there's a paper clip on here it's holding something on there see things are coming out oh she did the back side too wow okay i didn't do my back side angie hope you didn't do the whole back side and then this one's got pumpkins and this one's another little tag that i can use that comes out but I'm not going to use it. It's going to stay in there. And this one's got a pumpkin with a crow on it. Love these colored leaves like that. This looks awesome. All right, let's flip it over. See this? This came off a little bit, but we can get that back on there. All right, so she added like another... Is this tied to there? Yes. She added like another pocket here. Here, let's get this on here. Here. I think that goes like that. And the, these are um, shakers. That is cool. Let's see if I can open it. Can I open? Yep. So these are shakers. And look at it. It's got leaves in it and uh, the maple leaves and beads. And oh, that's pretty. And they're all little shakers. And she's got a paper clip down there. So it must like this and open out and it's a shaker what a clever clever idea that is just too cute and see there is stuff in the back of all of them so i'll pull it out from the front let's put this paper clip back on that is a very creative idea but see she's been making these oh she wrote me another little letter too look at that and it looks like a little letter oh all right oh look at i don't even want to open it oh oh cool Whew. all right Sorry, I'm just reading. Oh, that was nice. I like this. That is too cute. I wonder where she got that. That is so cute. All right. So in this one, we have some clips. And they look like they have, oh, they have different colors on them. These ones are more like fall. So we have some clip clips, close pins. And then this one's got some images. Look at those. Those are cool. The old images. And um, this is like a belt clip that you could use to wrap ribbon through on any kind of project, actually. Those are awesome. And then in this one, this one opens from the front here. Let's see. These are like, oh, I wonder if she punched these out because these are all on chipboard. These would be great for a Christmas pocket letter. Aren't those pretty? There's a whole bunch of them. I bet she cut these out. Those are really cool. Thank you, Angie. This is awesome, awesome pocket letter. But, I, I mean, I know you've been doing these for a while. I just completed my, you know, I started one a while ago that I haven't finished. And then I am in the pocket, uh, a swap with Angie and Amy. And so I actually finished my first two. So that's awesome. And then this was obviously in one of the pockets. And it's uh, tags with little... Uh, Confetti. Thank you. Confetti. And there's confetti in the bag as well. Those are really cute. So those go in one of the pockets. So let's just pick a pocket and stick it in there. And then we have all these little pieces of paper. And these are good. Oh, these are, these are cool. What are these? They're like little slides. I've never seen these. Those are really cool. And you can put a picture in there. You can put these on cards or mixed media or whatever they're like little slide things i've never seen those those are really cool so i got a bunch of these i got some white 
some black. So I got one, two, three black, I think, and two white. Oh, three black and three white. Those are really cool. And then pieces of, and then these uh, pieces of paper that you can put underneath them with something in between. So yep. those are really cool. I like those. And then this one goes in one of them. So that is awesome. Thank you so much, Angie. I love this. This idea right here with this um, this extra pocket back here with the shakers in it is really cool. Thank you so much. I'm going to try and fold this up. And I am going to make a book for all my pocket letters. And then she got me, oh, let's move my paper clip. I know i got to put that piece of paper back in there. And then it looks like she gave me a bunch of goodies. I love these bags that everybody uses. I don't know where everybody gets them. I don't have, well, I have some now just from collecting them. And I have a tag that says, boo, she sent me Halloween stuff. Look at the mason jar with the pumpkins in it. And it's sewn with vellum. That is too cute. Now I'll have some tags for next year. And some owl stickers. And of course, some purple bling. And some awesome purple paper. Great for a journal. Some bags. These are great for journals. Let's make all the journal I'm working in now. And this is like, um, I would use this for 4th of July or something. Yep, these are awesome. And a little book that says notes that I can uh, do whatever I want with. I can alter it if I want. Add some lace and stuff to it. Awesome. Thank you very much, Angie. I can't wait to send mine out to you. Thank you for the extra goodies and the tags. I love it. And I love, love, love my pocket letter. Thank you so much for asking me to do a fall pocket letter with you. And I can't wait to, till you get mine. All of Angie's information will be listed in the description box below. Go over, check her out, sub to her, and um, I will put her Facebook group as well. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you are not subscribed, please subscribe. I am always live on Fridays and live on Thursdays with Maggie. So thank you all for watching. I hope you have a wonderful weekend, and I will talk to you soon. Bye for now.